the FedEx. FedEx is here. I mean, my package might be here. My lights, my lights from my door might be here. My lights from my dorm, y'all. I'm so freaking excited. My lights from my door might be here. Oh, those hurt. Those my mama's shoes. Man, you got to be kidding me. I thought it might be my lights. <sighs> Welcome back to Beauty Health, also known as Asia Love, and today I am filming another back to school video. So, yeah, so before we hop right into the video, because before I hop right into the video today, I'm going to be sharing what's in my college backpack slash back to school supplies video because I thought, why not? Because I have all my school supplies already and I already put it in my backpack. So, yeah. So before we hop in the video, don't forget to follow me on my social medias. My Instagram, Snapchat, and Twitter will be linked down below. So yeah, and before we get into this video, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up if you'd like to see many more back to school videos because I have plenty more for you guys. And if you haven't already, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. I am Asia Web, also known as Beauty Health, and I film a lot of beauty and lifestyle and vlogs and whatever I feel like posting. So you should definitely join the family because I love every each and one of you. And if you are subscribed today, don't forget to turn on them post notifications so you can be notified every time I upload a new video. Because I upload every Sunday and Wednesday and I don't want you to miss out because sometimes I might have to upload on a different day if things are not able to work out for me. So yeah, let's just hop right into the video. Okay, so let's get right into it i'm gonna show you guys my backpack because it has literally everything freaking in it oh, it's heavy so this is my backpack <laughs> this backpack is for right Ryan, so i will link where i got this from i got this backpack off of amazon so if you guys would love to get this backpack they come in many different color colors and different sizes and have different styles i really like this backpack because it has that vintage feel and i really like it and it's very spacious also as well i wish i would have got the pink one because you know pink is my favorite color but you know black goes for everything as well so i'm not complaining and this is not sponsored i bought this backpack with my own money it was not very expensive it was i think less than 50 dollars so yeah so let's get right into it all right so i moved the camera up higher so you guys can see me but here's the backpack so there's a zipper right here and in this zipper i have some random red pins because these are not in the package so i have those in there and that's all that i have in this front pocket it's very nice and spacious but it's a little tight because i have stuff in the backpack but i feel like once i have stuff in there that i don't need it would be a lot more easier to put things in and out so yeah and then these things these are like buckles but they don't actually buckle they're just magnetic so they can clip on and off so you can just lift it up and go like that it looks like it has a little face and like it's talking and it's eating my pens so <sighs> sorry I have to put, if i don't put it back now i'm probably not gonna do it later so now on top of this there's another zipper and inside the zipper i have all of my nice school supplies so let's go through that so i have this pink stapler it's from simple swingler swing line whatever it comes with staples in it oh uh, wait it doesn't come with staples in it i lied to myself then i also have staples to fill up my stapler as well then inside here i have flag it post-it notes because you know in college i might be having to buy textbooks or even rent out my textbooks so if i have textbooks that i don't own i don't want to like brighten it and damage the property so i love using these i fell in love with using flat flat post-its my senior year of high school for ap english when we would have to annotate books that we couldn't use and these actually come in handy because if i need to take 
if I'm writing down notes or I need to take notes or I'm in the middle of a lecture, but it's not the right time to ask questions. I can just write it down so that way I don't forget what I need to ask to my professor or anybody else. So I really recommend these ones. And I really like the clear ones because they don't really leave any marks and you can actually see. I prefer the clear ones, but these ones are just as good. They just tend to rip more easily. Also into that, I have more post-it notes. I have these big ones right here these big posted super sticky ones with like the lines on them which is also really useful too as well like if i need to like make a study guide or something if you guys want if you want um a video on like how i took notes in high school i could definitely film that for you guys and i also have these post-its i love using these post-its because i can use them just to like mark a page or if I like don't understand something, I really, really love using these, especially when it comes to review time. These are my favorite. Also in there, I have um, ruled index cards. I love index cards, especially to study because, you know, sometimes when I use Quizlet, I can get like a little bit out of Quizlet because it's on my phone and it's electronically. So I really love using these, especially when I took AP Gov. These were my freaking best friends when it came to remembering case files and stuff. I freaking love these and I freaking recommend that you use index cards slash flashcards if you don't. I love these like vocabulary and stuff. And these are really great to use like if you want to quiz with friends instead of using Quizlet because you know it's electronically and sometimes I can get out of Quizlet and like go on Instagram or start shopping on freaking Amazon and spending coins. Cool. So we have writing utensils. I have these paper made flare vivid color crisp um felt tip pens. I love these pens so freaking much, but they're so expensive. But I have these ones that my parents bought for Christmas that I never use. I had two packs. But I definitely recommend the colorful packs. But these pens for the colorful packs is at least the big packs and for thirty dollars and I can take what I can get until I can put them on my Christmas list because you know you wanna be smart. Next thing I have is ink pens. So big are my favorite writing utensils because I'm a lefty and I hate when my stuff smear on the pages. Like I really hate when I write and it smears. So I pay attention to what I write and I always use the same stuff to write with. So I have these big pencils. I mean, not pencils, pens. So I have these big crystal extra bold ones. These are the colorful packs and it comes with black a dark green, a light green, a red, a light blue, a dark blue, and a pink and a purple. So I really love these. These are one of the best freaking pens I ever used in my life. Then I also have the big crystal extra smooth pens. These are just in the tr traditional blue, and these are the traditional black. And then I have the red ones in the front pouch in the beginning. Then I also have big pencils. These are the extra light pencils. And this is with um, the 0 0.7 milliliter worth the lead so i have these packs some are already open because you know because they were just already open so that's everything that was in this front pouch so going on this the second big pouch right here this is the biggest pouch so in this pouch i have freaking tape because i might need tape you know rip the page or something and my notebook need to tape it back up or anything something up in my dorm you never freaking know so i have tape then i have my agenda oh we're not agenda a planner so this is my planner um if you're wondering where i got this planner i think this planner i believe i got from walmart but it goes from july of 2019 all the way to june 2020 and it's monthly and weekly and i really like because there's tabs and stuff on the side so i can easily find where i need to go so i really like this and it's plus it's made 100 percent out of recycled goods so i really also like that as well i also have this journal and it says just be yourself which is real freaking 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 cute i love it my mom actually picked this up for me and it has this little thing right here so you can mark where you last um wrote at which i really enjoy and it comes with 192 pages and it's just pink and purple so and it, it's not like line paper it's just dots so i can write any kind of way i want so yeah it's and it's also perforated which means i can rip out the pages 
which I like because you know sometimes I might have something in here I don't want to write. Y'all, the FedEx FedEx is here. <laughs> Going back into the video, I have my notebooks. I have more notebooks than these, but these three um these three notebooks I have are so freaking cute. So this one has a blue reindeer on them. I got these notebooks also from Walmart. This one is blue with metallic -y silver on it, which is also cute. And then I have this notebook that says No Problem Llama. No Problem Llama. So this is also cute. Then also in this, I also have folders. Well, these right here are folders. And all my folders, yes, are black because... I wanted all my folders to be black because I didn't have enough pink folders. So I just decided to make them all black. And then I can just label them with some markers, like a, a white marker. Huh? What is it? Hold on, I'm filming a video. Okay. They just don't respect the YouTube crying. It's like, no. But then after that, I have these report covers because I might have to write papers and stuff. I just feel like it's more professional to put them in a report cover. And that way my stuff don't get bended up and everything. So, I have a report cover. And that's almost everything. Now. So next, I have this one inch binder. But in this binder, I just have all my sheet protectors because I prefer using binders. And if I have loose leaf papers and stuff, I prefer to put them in sheet protectors so that way they don't rip and they can stay where they need to be. And I just personally, there's a certain way I like to set up my binders. So that's why I have sheet protectors and it's a great way to put my syllabus in them because I like to have my syllabus looking nice and sleek all year long. So I prefer that if you don't have um, sheet protectors, you should go mine and get you some. And then last but not least, I have this big old four inch binder that I plan to use and carry around campus because I, that's just personally what I'm used to doing at high school. And I'm going to see if it works for um, college. And if you do, it do. If you don't, it don't. You know, it's one of those things. So in this, I have dividers because I need to divide up my classes. These are just the Avery um, the five big tap right in a race dividers and then also in here i have the rest of my notebooks so i have a blue notebook a red one and then i got a yellow one and i also got these on walmart everything that i have came from walmart because you know it is what it is but yeah i just that's everything that i got for school school supplies usually i would have a lot more school supplies for this but i'm going to college i'm not going to high school and i'm not going to need as much school supplies i'm not going to run through as much because you know people it's not going to be trying to steal as much like when you walk away from your desk to go like blow your nose and then people steal your mechanical pencil hopefully they ain't they ain't that grimy in college i'm hoping and praying to god but i really downsized and only got school supplies that i really felt like i needed and enjoyed so that's pretty much it for this video this is everything what's in my college backpack plus my school supplies haul and i really hope you guys enjoyed this video to the moon and back and i would say i see you guys very soon or i see you on the flip side don't forget to catch up with me on all my social medias and i love you all to the moon and back bye